Hi there. Welcome to MCSI. My name is Emma. In this video, I will demonstrate some monitoring tools that you can use during OSINT investigations. Are you wondering how monitoring tools would be beneficial? When you are investigating a target person or business, you may want to keep an eye on social media posts, news, blog posts, etc. Monitoring tools come in handy then. There are commercial and free options available. Now, I will tell you about some of them. For a target person or business, Mentionlytics can identify posts and mentions on the major social media platforms and gather web content. I have performed a search for the Japanese food company Nissin. Latest data is presented first. You can also choose to view results for a specific time range. You can view the latest activity graph here. It indicates the number of posts and mentions on the platforms listed here. Here you can view the latest web content. You can also analyze activity on a per-platform basis. Additionally, you can configure the tools to send you regular email notifications. For instance, the tool will notify you only when specific keywords are observed in the findings. You can also apply filters to your email notification. During a critical OSINT investigation, say when the target being investigated, these tools are extremely useful. Brand24 is another similar analysis tool with monitoring capabilities. When you specify a keyword or a hashtag, Brand24 can assess over 100 platforms and display all results where the search term has been mentioned. I have already created a project to search for the hashtag Digital Forensics. We are currently viewing the results for the last month. We can specify a custom range to view the results for. We can view the posts and statistics about them. These are the list of platforms from which content is analyzed. You can also configure the tool to send you notifications in real time. You can add filters to easily get a view on interesting posts and mentions. You can also configure this tool to send you reports regularly. We observe two commercial tools to monitor a bunch of social media platforms on a large scale. Now, I will tell you about some monitoring tools that are specific to a platform. Have you used Snapchat? It is an instant messaging application that lets you share images and create publicly accessible stories. This is SnapMap, that lets you monitor Snapchat activity all over the world. You can zoom into a particular region to find out what people are talking about on Snapchat. In most cases, content posted by users is about current activity in that region. You can click on a post to view its contents. If the OSINT professional is unable to be physically present in a region, they can track activity in real time in that location. Live Universal Awareness Map depicts news content on a map, on topics like investigations, fires, use of weapons, political unrest, etc. The events are indicated by unique icons. You can also read about each event on the right pane. The information currently presented is in real time. You can configure the time range for which you want to view information for. TGStat is a tool that you can use to monitor content on Telegram channels and groups. Try it out. Have you configured Google Search Engine to send you alerts on latest web content? If not, take a look at another video on our channel. The description box has the link to it. I will tell you about another tool that you can use to monitor web content. 
I have used Talkwalker to send me email alerts every day in real time for latest web content on coronavirus. When you create the alert, you can configure the content the tool will monitor on your behalf. This is an alert that I received a while ago. I hope you have a good idea now about how monitoring tools can be used during an OSINT investigation. Here is a project idea for you. Pick a target person. From preliminary investigation on one of their social media profiles, identify any hobbies or interests of that person. Use monitoring tools, configure keyword-based searches, and monitor the major social media platforms for latest activity involving the target. Try it out. If you liked this video, please hit like and share this video on social media. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to receive more videos like this one. Join our online community of students learning useful cybersecurity skills if you haven't already. To register for a free account right away, go to our website. Happy learning and see you soon!